Hey gang, Scotty Garbitas here, back on the Hypermind server, and today we're going to do a little bit of building here at our spawn house. Alright, first off, I got a gift basket. It says, a welcoming gift basket for a new neighbor. Enjoy Torbs, which is Torbray. I will have a link to his channel down in the description. We got some cookies and we got some cakes. But we're going to be building a spawn house. Now, my idea is kind of a late 1940s, 1950s, like post-war house. They usually were pretty small, and uh, it was just as the suburbs were beginning to form. And so, I don't know if you can tell, but I've got a little layout here. I'm going to build the house as we're talking. And let's see, do I have stuff to build this? I think I do. Blocks of quartz. Boom. All right, we'll start with this. So, my thought is this will be kind of a siding pattern and then on the corners you know you've always got those channels that the water comes down in the siding so we're gonna have that kind of a pattern going on along the house let's put in some corner posts here so right now I'm at PAX Prime with Basket MC having a great time hopefully I've been sharing some pictures via Twitter and you guys have been enjoying those. Let's see here, four? All right, four. I will not have a window there. You guys will see why here in a little bit. Let's switch out picks too. We want Scotty's sexy pick. There we go. Super sexy. I didn't know what else to call it. It has all of the attributes that I would want in an efficiency pick, so we went with that. All right, this is gonna be a little garage that we can pull a vehicle into. So we're gonna need a corner here. Let's see, do we need, do we need that to be separate there? You know, I don't know if we do. We'll, we'll, we'll get to that when the time comes, I guess. For now, we'll leave it as is. Yeah, I'm wondering, maybe we should just take that across, like that, and these will all be the same pattern. I'm thinking that's the ticket right there. So, yeah, that looks better. I like that. Cool, cool. And then where we've got the dirt, that's uh, my way of marking where windows need to go. So we'll go ahead and we'll take this out here, and I love the inverted stairs and regular stairs for the openings that's gonna be a huge picture window in an eat-in kitchen so maybe we'll have the table like right here and then we'll have some of the kitchen stuff around in that corner there but I'm thinking that this uh, this is work gonna work well for the pattern we have going on let's go ahead we'll put in this other corner down here and then I'm gonna grab some more quartz do I have more? This is iron. That's iron. That's iron. I've been out to the iron farm today. Let's go ahead and 27. We'll use these up. So we've got one, two, three, four there. Now this was a window. All right. Oh, come on now. Let's get this going. So I'm hoping that this will work as a cool little style for my house. Let's go ahead and we'll take these guys out. Put in the wind. Oh no! Put in the window there. And do I have any more stairs? I do not. All right, I'm gonna go get some more materials made up, guys, and then I'll catch back up with you here in a second. All right, we finished this back wall. I've got some more materials. I also put in an inverted stair right here to go into the garage. And you know what? While I'm thinking about it, we'll put one right there to go out of the kitchen into the garage and let's go ahead we'll put in this other corner over here and we'll just keep on building so what else do we have going on right now um today is the last day of august let me see if i got my math right here yeah today is the last day of august which means rocket league is technically no longer the new month new game tomorrow so we've got to have a new game what will it be for september well, I have not yet decided as of this recording, so it'll probably be a surprise for all of us. 
I'm hoping I'll come across a game I'm really enjoying at PAX and I can bring it back and I can share it with you as soon as I get back. That would be awesome. Um, the other thing that is possibly going on, I shouldn't say possibly, that is for sure going on is if you haven't seen it already, Basket MC and I have already completed Ragecraft and we are beginning a new map tomorrow called The Minimalist. It is a CTM map where every level is 24 blocks by 24 blocks by 24 blocks. You heard me right. It's all, a whole level is confined in that space. So that should be very exciting and a lot of fun. Uh, we've already recorded a few episodes in advance, so we'd be prepared when we went to PAX. And I'm really looking forward to it. And I hope you are too. Let's see, this one needs to go vertical. So we don't have any of the uh, side bits showing. Let's go ahead and I will show you guys my awesome little <laughs> KV storage hole right now. This is where I'm living and sleeping. Go ahead and sleep this night off. And as you can see, there are more than one person on the server here on the Hypermind server, but we have a one person sleep system. I honestly don't know who set it up, but I'm a huge fan of it. This is the front door. This is the front door. All right. And I know it looks real plain and simple right now, but there's going to be a walkway, a little bit of a roof that comes down over like this. And oh, yeah, we've got this little guy right here to kind of keep it separated from the rest of the house here as well. Oh, yeah, Scotty Land. Yay! Oh, no, fail. All right, so how much of our house do we have left to do here? We've got the windows, we got the doorway in. Let's run around the side here. Windows. Boom, boom, boom. All right, and then we have to figure out a garage door of some sort. And I don't know how that'll work. We'll have to see. That kind of looks, that doesn't look very good. We'll have to see what I can pull off for the, uh, for the garage door. Hmm, give me some comments. I won't have that finished in this episode. But we do need to move to the roof. What should I use for the ceiling here? Hmm, I'm thinking perhaps, man, I really don't know. I am stuck. You know what? That doesn't matter because I need to finish this. All right, so we'll get this wrapped up here. Um, yeah, these inner walls need fixed up. And this is going to be a bathroom, I believe. So we will go ahead and put that wall in like that. Man, starting to see some errors in my planning. Quartz. There we go. We're going to need Uh-oh. Brain block. The words are getting stuck. We're going to need this wall here. This is going to be the bathroom. We are going to need an inverted stair right there. And then we can just shoot this guy across like this. Cool. And what if we do an inverted stair and an inverted stair there? It's kind of a little walkway. And then we'll throw some quartz pillars up like that. So this is, you'll come into the living room. And then this guy here will be a solid wall. Do we have all the walls in? We do not. That's a walkway right there. No, this is a walkway right here. Stairs, wall. All right. 
see if we can get this all figured out, at least in this episode, while we're just hanging out here. Building our little spawn house. I'm digging it. Uh, could this be a vertical pillar right there? And what about this guy here? You need to be sideways guy. Right? Sideways all the way across. Yep. Sideways. Corner pillars. Hmm. We've been doing sideways for most of this. I know I was just saying how this all needed to be vertical. Well, let's try this out, and then you guys can give me some comments. And we'll just call this an episode when we get done putting these walls in. And I will wait for feedback from you before I finish any of that. So we'll go an inverted stair there and there. So it'll be just like across the way there. Quartz pillar. Boom, boom. All right, I'm digging that. Got the windows. So inside the house, we should have all sideways pillars. That's what I'm thinking. It'll give it some matching patterns throughout the house. This right here gonna work like that. And then through the garage down into the basement. Is that what we got going on here? I think so. Let's look here. All those guys are lining up. All these lines. Cool. I'm digging this so far. It's just a little living room. And we're going to have some stairs to the upstairs. We'll have to figure out what we're going to do for the floor. And how we're going to how we're going to deal with that. But I'm excited. We'll probably end up doing a double thickness on the floor. But let's go ahead. Let's jump out here. Let's take a little peek. Hopefully you guys can see what I see, but there's going to be a little pathway that probably comes around like this, and maybe a path that comes around from there, maybe a little water feature down here. Big picture window into the kitchen with the eating area. Big picture window into the living room. And then we'll have some privacy here along the side where the sidewalk is, but in the back of the house we'll have a window. Maybe for this bathroom, we'll do a window that's raised up for privacy. There we go. But there'll be a window for the bathroom. This is this a big giant window into the garage? Hmm. Did I really want a big giant window in this garage here? I don't think I did. Kitchen. Entryway, hallway, stairs upstairs. I think this needs to come out. I do. Let's see here. We need more quartz. Well, let's go down into the basement. We'll grab some real quick. We'll make a few more quartz pillars. And then we'll wrap this up. I know I've said that already a couple times, but this time it's true. We're going to wrap it up. All right. So I'm digging it. We'll also have a little driveway that comes around here so we can pull our car in. Maybe I'll show you guys my rendition of a an old school car here in the driveway. Maybe I'll get some inspiration from somewhere. But this is the beginnings of my spawn home. I'm Scotty Garbitas. This is the Hypermind server. Thanks for watching. Click like, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Click like, subscribe, oh my, it's Scotty!